I'm gonna tell you right now, I'm so proud of you. So I'm proud of each and every one of you guys. We battled through a ton of adversity this week. Weather, soupy field, injuries, people getting sick, the whole deal. And all your dreams and all your goals are still in front of you. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'm so proud of you guys. Fantastic effort, fantastic job. Get a break. Love you. Go so Let's go. Everything that we did in the offseason was to win this game. Whether it was scheduling, weight room, seven on sevens camps. This game, um, as a coaching staff, we had circled on uh, our schedule because we know what type of effort it takes to, um, to win this game. And, and you need all hands on deck. I think we really pride ourselves on physicality um, and, you know, flying around seven hats to the ball. We, we're realists. We know we're not going to get all 11, but seven hats to the ball is our big focal point for us. So just flying around and showing what we're capable of. We got a lot of guys who are pretty strong. You know, Jamar hit 225 30 times. So we, we like flying around and uh, flexing a little bit, but props to them. That was a really good Oakridge team. They battle. Uh, uh, they're going to do really well in the postseason. Uh, I just want to add on, you know, it all starts with our D-line. Our D-line's always getting good pushes, so um, we don't get to make plays on the outside or on the inside without our D-line. So exactly. Cre credit well, like I said earlier, I think sky's the limit. I think, like Sig tells us every day, uh, make sure we end the day with our goal still ahead of us. Tonight, we definitely ended with our goal still ahead of us. So that's our, you know, that's our biggest goal is keeping our goals ahead of us. And so far, I think we're doing a really good job of that based off of our team's buy-in. Um, you know, everybody really wants to keep playing until the snow comes. So, you know, I think we're on pace to do that. This upcoming week, we're just going to focus on getting better. One week at a time, obviously, we got a pretty good Ludington team coming up. Yeah. They've, they've been keeping it close with a lot of teams in the conference. So we're, we're going to have to go out there, work hard, and obviously get better day by day. Oh, that's 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 a very strong Whitehall team. Uh, definitely, I think, yeah, the number of pieces that they have. And like I say, their depth, I mean, you know, they rotated jersey numbers, and they, they were still coming. So, um they, they should make a nice long run in the playoffs, I, I hope, you know, represent the conference well.